Chris Wagner from Pilot Point, Texas. Uh, predominantly work on Western Pleasure Show horses, halter horses, and uh, lameness in a podiatry clinic. Definitely soundness. Um, we've we've uh, definitely bred some good quality feet and legs off of them, and uh, they're not getting any smaller horses. And uh, it's it's very difficult to keep these horses sound. You have to be willing to, to think outside of the box a little bit and uh, maybe develop something new that you can use to assist you and assist the trainer um, and work together obviously to try and achieve a, a mutual result um, and, and obviously the experience from your elder horseshoes as well. I usually call in my vets pretty quick. I have a team of two to three vets that I work with and um, anytime I have a, a little bit of question on what might be going on, I, I get them in there right away to do my x-rays and uh, it just sets us up for success. Um, I'm really big on x-rays and it eliminates your, your chances of error. It, it's my little cheat sheet I always say. Workability. Um, I've redesigned my rig probably three times. You know, I bought a, a name brand rig. Um, before that, I had two cargo trailers. Um, and definitely taking the time to think about what kind of horses you're shoeing and what you're gonna need and uh, designing your rig based around that because you need to be thinking about working on your horse. You don't need to be thinking about this is in the wrong spot or this isn't, this isn't you know, isn't convenient. You need to have it workable for you. And, and when I'm redesigning my rig and rebuilding my rig, I just go through my motions of what I'm gonna do that day. You know, especially for clinic work, you gotta build a lot of things. So I wanna be able to have all the things necessary to build what I need to build right there. So workability for sure.